Over the past four decades, we've seen it all, from Lindy Chamberlain to Benjamin Hoffman. Croc attacks, cyclones and crime, plus political coups and scandals. Tonight, we take a look back at the stories and characters that have shaped the Territory 40 years since our first news broadcast. October 18, 1982. The NT still in its infancy, just a few years into self-government. Our first news was beamed into Darwin lounge rooms. Good evening, Clive Murray and Jan Guerin from Darwin with the first edition of News at 7. Back then we were still Channel 8, but have always been a vital part of the Nine Network. And today marks 40 years of delivering the news you care about. Community-based community news is where it all begins for us. Before we get to federal, national, international level, um, to be in the community, we've got to be there local. Darwin is a totally unique place. It's a place in Australia, it's a place in our culture, it's a place in Asia. Uh, and you get to tell totally unique stories being in the newsroom there. There's the crime cases that have captured the world, from the Chamberlain's 30-year legal battle... We're relieved and delighted to come to the end of this saga. The disappearance of Peter Falconio, and more recently Ben Hoffman's shooting rampage through Darwin. The natural disasters from floods to cyclones, mosquitoes and crocs. And you can't forget the wild and wacky characters. <laughs> I just grabbed the frying pan and gave an almighty smack on the nose. And who can forget the madness that is sometimes territory politics? From members resigning in disgrace to backstabbing while overseas, midnight coups and penthouse press conferences, and sometimes they're surprisingly lost for words. Well, there isn't a conspiracy. That, that, so I know by not knowing. They're like. As for those who dedicate their lives to bringing you the news, there's been many both in front and behind the camera. But it's in our standing ground, not just for uh, reporters, but for camos, producers, for news directors. It was a place you were able to learn and grow and be part of the community and see uh, the place change with these huge events. President Obama's visit, the signing of the INPEX deal, the Territory Thunder, all the events that happen in Asia, it only happens in a place like Darwin. And because of that, we're not going anywhere. Kathleen Gazzola, Nine News.